The 2024 election is likely to be very close. Like the 2020 presidential election and the 2016 election before that, it could come down to a few thousand voters in a few states. To win these key states, candidates both need to persuade people to vote for them and convince them to turn out to vote. So, where will we see these key indicators of whether a candidate has been successful? One area to look at is big cities, such as Detroit in Michigan's Wayne County, Charlotte in North Carolina's Mecklenburg County, or Atlanta in Georgia's Fulton County. These are areas that historically have voted for Democrats, so the number of people who turn out to vote in these areas could be important to offset Democratic losses in the more rural or Republican-leaning parts of these key states. Second, the suburbs always matter. The counties around the cities of Milwaukee in Wisconsin and Philadelphia in Pennsylvania are really important to the statewide vote. These suburbs have been steadily moving toward the Democratic Party in recent years, but if a Republican candidate could begin to win back some of these voters, that could go a long way in helping them retake each state. The third place to look at is really large counties. Clark County in Nevada and Maricopa County in Arizona are each home to more than 60% of their state's voters. In those counties, the margins really matter and could make a big impact on the final statewide numbers. So as you're watching results come in on November 5th, take a look at these types of places to get a sense for where the statewide race is going.